I'm still here. That's okay. This is day 17, 18. I don't know. Hi friends. Welcome back. I'm Ella and today I'm going to share with you my full on review about Penta Hotel as one of the designated hotel quarantine in Hong Kong. So for you guys, fellow travelers who are still looking for quarantine hotel, I hope this is helpful. So now I'm gonna give you a quick tour before we move on to the more detailed review about every little corner of this room. All right, let's start the room tour. Let's go. So Penta has three types of room, the standard room, connecting rooms, and the suite. Penta has two packages to offer for the quarantine. Number one is Penta standard package, and number two is Penta plus package. For both packages, they offer the same room, which is the standard room, like the one that I showed you. The only difference are the food that they serve and the floor level of the room. As the standard, they serve balanced eat meal. For plus, they serve eat well menu. So if you book for the Penta Plus package, you get a better meal supposedly, and you got a room in the higher floor of the hotel. Penta Plus package quarantine costs 800 Hong Kong dollars per night. So it's 300 Hong Kong dollars difference. For me to pay 300 Hong Kong dollars extra, just for a better food, I feel like that I can just order out anything I want for 800 but again it's your preference honestly the food that Penta serve are actually okay so they offer different menu every day for one week and then it become repetitive for the next two weeks and that's when we got bored and we just want to order out but there is an other review from other hotel to this hotel is way better um, I'm so thankful it's not only edible but it is quite decent it's that the boredom of the same food every week that gets to us but other than that it's okay again it's your own preference so some information about my room this is a connecting rooms so my room is with twin bed and the other room is with king bed Price for one night for one person per room is 500 Hong Kong dollars. I personally think that this is one of the best deals in terms of the price. 
so one set of connecting room costs 1,000 Hong Kong dollars. It's all included with three meals per day and also with the tax. And for some people who's asking, do you pay your own hotel room? Or the company paid for you? Oh, sadly, because this is not a duty flight, so I have to pay it from my own pocket. So in total for 21 nights, remember book it for 21 nights, not 21 days. So for 21 nights in total, I have to pay 10,500 Hong Kong dollars. So now let's start from the check-in process once you arrive in the hotel. You will be given this welcome folder when you check in at the hotel. This folder contains all of the information and also some rules during your quarantine stay. The check-in process was pretty quick. I think it's because there were only 5 of us arrived at the same time. They all say it's a must for you to read all of this and I think it's a really good idea just to make yourself familiar with all of the hotel rules so you don't get fined. There's information about useful number in case of health emergency and also there's your meals menu, meal delivery time, garbage pickup time, and room service menu. During check-in process, your credit card will be charged 1,500 Hong Kong dollars for deposit. After everything settled, then they will give you the one-time use hotel room key. It's time to say goodbye to the outside world and go to your room. So for now, I'm gonna give you the before and after I rearrange everything because when I land and arrive at the hotel, I'll, I clean up everything, I rearrange everything not knowing that, Ella, you haven't taken any photo. So thankfully, very kind fellow travelers who stayed at Penta Hotel are willing to share their photos with me. So here it is, before and after. What are the things that they provide and the stuff that I brought to get you some ideas of what to expect when you walk in the room. talk about the food so they serve three meals per day breakfast lunch and dinner so for breakfast they usually serve you with some Chinese style breakfast like congee fried noodles and also some soup they always give you some kind of drinks some days is the soya bean milk and the other day is the sugarcane drink I never drink this so I just collect them and hopefully I don't know, they can give it to someone or something if they think I'm not contagious. For the breakfast, it's not really up to my liking because for breakfast, I prefer waffles and pancakes. I'm just joking. For this quarantine, I prefer to eat some fruits, yogurt, um, cereal, and some smoothie. Pretty basic, I got my supplies of vegetables and fruits from Food Panda Delivery and our kind friends who are willing to shop for us and deliver it to the hotel. 
Thank you. Me and my friend both booked the Penta Standard Quarantine Package. So good news is, Penta has various meals options. Normal meal, halal meal, vegetarian, non-seafood meals. to take it to the room from 9 in the morning to 10 at night which is pretty reasonable and they deliver it within 10 minutes hello <laughs> Some of my friends were confused, like, you are under quarantine, how come you are with a friend? So, some hotel allow people who land on the same flight to stay together in the same room during the whole quarantine. But please check again, because I know some hotels like Jen only allow families, not friends, to stay together in one room or to book connecting room. If I can make a list of the pros and cons of this Penta Hotel as the quarantine hotel, here are some things that I can say about it. They can probably help you consider whether to book this hotel or not. Number one, it is super helpful for Penta to accept our tentative booking before the fourth cycle list from the government. We were a bit worried because other hotels couldn't accept any booking confirmation until the cycle is up. We were pretty nervous because our departure to Hong Kong was early June and the new list only came out towards the end of May. So with the help from Penta, we managed to make tentative booking. At least they got our name, our date of arrival, our full personal information and then when the list is out and Penta is still one of the designated quarantine hotels, they would email us and ask for the payment. That's when we get our confirmations. Thank you so much, Penta. So if you're facing a similar case like we do, please ask your hotel just in case they can accept tentative bookings too. Or just book Penta Hotel. It's great. <laughs> so number two is definitely the price. If you're sharing the room, then it's gonna be even cheaper. Number three is modern and simple interior design of the hotel. And the room is pretty clean. Next one is great lighting and its ambience. The room is not super spacious, but it is comfortable. They have a great aircon system 
and it's not noisy we got some big windows although it's not the best view though but it's okay you can ask for extra drinking water without any charge because I heard some of other hotels ask you to just boil the tap water but not the case in Penta now what's not so great about Penta don't worry it's a short list number one is the flat pillows but you can ask for extra there are not many drawers in this room for you to store your stuff so you just have to maximize and make it tidy another thing is the Wi-Fi or internet connection I don't have to do any work zoom meetings or stuff like that but whenever I video call my friends or families it's gonna get disconnected sometimes it's not awful but it's not amazing and the last one this hotel doesn't provide you with a vacuum cleaner to borrow so that's it guys my full review of Penta Hotel if you can't tell already whether we're enjoying our stay or recommend this hotel or not yes we do thank you so much guys for watching I hope this is helpful if you see values and you find this video helpful consider subscribing Thank you again and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!